and where you can buy it. And this is Lisa, Lisa James. Hello. Right, so this is in Vapor's March. Uh, we're just about here, and the closest way shrine is here. Thoughts. Give me much so you, yeah, you can see that uh, I can bite you from here. Right, so. Uh, right, so here it is. So I'm going to zoom in out so you can see. It's right near the boss, and I'm going to show you some other locations. And as we're travelling, we're going to just. Uh, Lisa can explain some stuff, and I'm going to explain some stuff. So let's get to the next one. Right, so there's lots of different ways of doing the werewolf. Would you like to explain, Lisa, or do you want me to? Yeah, I can explain. Okay. Um, one of the first ways is to get a bite from a friend. So um, the, the uh, friend has to be level 6 on the werewolf skill line and have the Blood Moon passive activated. They can give one bite per week every seven days. Once they've bitten, they can't bite again for seven days. So um, very often you can get that bite for free. Some people do charge, but you need to be careful to make sure that you do get a bite if you that you pay for it. If you that if you pay for it, you do get a bite. You can also buy it in Crown Store at the moment. At the time of the video going out, it is one thousand five hundred crowns. To so that's real money. So just so you're aware, but you can get it in Crown Store as well. You can have it being gifted, but please be careful of that because it's actually classed as illegal. Um, currently in game, it's so doable, but people do put, give bite with gold and then they give you crown. We'll have to bank her eye first, and then I'm going to Reaper's match uh, the cool. last. That's so we're just going to travel to Reaper's match. I've got, for any werewolf bite, you will need to get the werewolf up. So I'm going to just stand here while this explains a little bit more why and why we're travelling about. Um, yeah, so that... Yeah, go up. Sorry. The, um, to, when you actually want to bite someone, this is something I didn't realise when I first started, is that you have to have your ultimate full. So I actually went to the, the biting shrine with an ultimate empty and didn't realise. Luckily the person I was biting was very patient and waited for me. But you do have to have your ultimate up. It's not just enough to go to the to the shrine and actually just be there. You've got to have your ultimate full. So you might have to run around a little bit just to get your ultimate up because it takes a little while with the werewolf to get it up. Then you can go to the shrine and you'll be able to give your bite. So I'm going to show you each of the stands. This one is going to be Bankrai. So you go to this way shrine and we travel over to just over here. I'll zoom out of this place so you can see where the way shrine is. And then we're going to walk over to this other side. But before I get over there, I'm just going to get the wolf up. Just so you can see you can bite. And it doesn't really matter on your alliance. Uh, for this, um, when the first the game began, you used to have to get a, a bite originally from a, a wolf in the night. And it's a very rare drop, it still does happen and it only happens on a full moon in the places where you get bites. And it's a, you can do it from the vampire, it's... It's very hard to do, but if you do get it from the blood moon or the blood... I think it's called the blood vampire. I can't rem quite remember. Is it the vampire? I think uh, so, but I've, it's so rare. I've honestly never seen it. I know where uh, people I know have had it. Yeah, uh, some people are lucky. They go to the right place at the right time, and there is a wild vampire or wild werewolf, and they do get bitten. So you could be lucky enough to get it that way. Some people um, online there's maps of where the where the um, where they appear. Because I checked that out before I bought my werewolf bike. Because I, I bought mine with crowns originally. That's the way I, I got mine. Um, but I looked at that. Um, but it looked really, really tricky to try and find a full moon and get it all done. So I didn't in the end. But they did say online that it's very rare. Mm. But not impossible. So go and have a look. Definitely. But please ask in zone chat if you haven't got a friend or guild chat for a vampire yeah. bike. 
because um, some of them do charge you. You've got to be quite wary and people do rip you off and don't give you the bike. We've heard of this yeah, a, a number of yeah. times. Yeah. Right, there's a lot of guilds though that where you can just ask, like Naomi um, X Guy just said, you can ask in guild chat and um, ask for a bite, and you'll be able to get a bite for free. A lot of guilds do do that, so it's always good to try before you, you know, decide what you're going to do and how you're going to go about getting the, um, get yourself a werewolf. Right, so this is the shine for another shine. Uh, once we're here, I'm going to turn into my wolf. And then we're going to travel, I'm going to show you where to get killed. And I'm going to show you on the guild store as well at the end where to, if you want to use crowns. Right, I'm just going to turn into my wolf now. Just to show that we can bite and then we do the, we're going to be doing the bite at the rift. Just so you've seen the different areas and just so you can see the different ways and different places we can go. Right, so I'm going to, I'm going to back away before I accidentally bite her. Right, so we're just here. Um, so just here. So, right. So we're gonna head to the rift now. I'm gonna kill some stuff on the way, and I'm gonna go up to the place where you can use gold to cure yourself of werewolf and vampire. So this place will be used for vampire and werewolf. Um, it's the magic guild in the rift. I will go take you to the place, they're just up the stairs, but I'm going to show you personally. Um, and the biggest price I've seen for a vampire slash werewolf is 100k. I don't know if you've seen any, yeah. Deva? No, nothing higher than that, but all sorts of prices I've seen in, Gil in, sorry, in um, zone chat. I've seen people asking all sorts of things, to be honest. So you just have to be careful, really, when you're doing that. So when you go to get it, if you want to get it cured, um, you go to someone called the Priest of RK, and the Priest of RK will cure you. Um, I, I think, how much was it? When it was it 690 something gold? Mm -hmm. It was to cure mm -hmm. me. Uh, not very expensive. So it's not something that you. It's not too much if you decide you don't like it. But the great thing about getting your werewolf cured is if you get your werewolf up to any level on your skills, any level, whatever level it is, and you cure the werewolf and then you decide later, like, ah, I really would like to be a werewolf again, and you get rebitten, uh, your skills start at exactly the same point as you left them. So you won't lose any skill points by curing it and then getting reinfected. Mm. So you can just uh, go straight back in. Mm. And there is currently a few um, achievements you can do as a werewolf. Would you like to talk about that, Lisa, or do you want me to? Oh, I don't know them all, but there are some fantastic ones. Uh, you have to, it's devour, they call it devour, which is the bit where once you've um, killed an enemy, you sort of um, eat, well, eat them <laughs> to repower you back, your werewolf back up. You have to do a hundred of the, of the eating but then there's three specific ones that you have to do to get a special achievement there's uh you have to devour someone in uh mournhold way rest and where was the other one elden root and you have to devour someone there and you'll get a special achievement for that so i was just, i've just been working on that one myself okay let's uh head to, let's head to the rift there is one okay. to get in up to um, a level 10. That is one of the basic ones. And biting another player. So that is one of the... Where is the rift? No. Um, on the right hand there, side. There, yes. Naomi is blind. I always do that with my map. I don't know if um, if the viewers do the same. That when you're trying to find somewhere, you have trouble. Where is it again? <laughs> Right, so I'm going to first take you up to the place where we, where you would need to go if you want a cure for the bite. Um, and then we're going to walk up to the last one and then you'll see the bitten. And then once Lisa has been bitten, she'll get a quest that will pop up on the uh, screen. I will show you that at some point. But that'll be a different video because I'll have to get someone to bite me because I cannot walk in with her to do the quest, shameless. Yeah. Um, but I will try and do, try and get another video of that soon, um, whenever I get a chance. Hmm, that might be a possibility. Hmm. 
yeah so I'll try and do that video eventually a bit later say about the world streams um, right so so we're in town here in the Rifton Way Shrine um, we're gonna head straight to the uh, the shrine and the magic guild I'm thinking where we're going then so you go straight to the magic guild and it looks like a uh, uh, Wizard James has just DC'd. This game is having a lot of problems with DCing, so we're gonna wait until she comes back. Oh, I was sent for you. Yeah, um, he's just crashed, she'll be back in a few minutes, so we'll start off and just carry on with this video. Right, so you come straight up the stairs and you talk to this guy. So I, I no longer want to be a vampire and then you give him the money and then you are cured of the vampire. So there is an offering and it's 693 gold. Okay. Right, so I'm going to level up my werewolf where we'll let um, Lizzie James come back in. Um, sorry about the the bit of a, might be a little bit of a wait, but there's not much I can really do about the deals, uh, about the, the crashing a lot at the moment. It's currently waiting to be fixed on the 2nd or 3rd of December really a little lunch on that but it's not too bad we'll get our vamp wolf up while we're waiting and then you can see the initial bite you will need to suppress circle and triangle when you are doing this um so I, i'm just going to kill some stuff then try and remember where the wolf is Right, so we'll just oh, oh that's not uh, the best thing of trying to get the wolf up is is to try and stay on the same bar of the cat of the wolf yarn because with my character I've got two different bars. I'm just going to heal myself. So that's wonderful. Um, it looks like she's logging back in. Oh, welcome Hello. back. I'm very sorry, my game crashed. It's left me back where I was. So I'm going to try and travel uh, to uh, Naomi X Sky again in the rift, and fingers crossed I get there. And anyway, look, uh, I'm just leveling up the wolf. I've just shown them where the bats would get cured and how much it Lovely. was. So we're all being cured. I'm just watching me kill mammoths at the moment. All splendid. The good thing about this one is there's a load of mammoths and giants just near the just near the um, shrine, so it's quite nice. It's quite a good one to get to. Right, my to wolf is up. Um, level, um, leveling the wolf back up. I'm just waiting for. Um, I've got to remember where it is. I'm probably it's gonna have to follow. Just by the giant boss, to the left and slightly up near the giant boss. This is the one I use for biting. I don't know why. It's just the one I like. <laughs> Oh, everyone likes different ones, it's so cool. I know yeah, I'm not far from nice. it. So. I'm just on a load screen and then I'll be with you in just a second. No, no worries, I've just explained to them that you just crashed and at the moment there's a current glitch and hoping to be fixed by, I think it was the 2nd or the 3rd, I can't remember quite yeah, which 2nd of December it said online, but both things are changing at the moment, so periodically they put out a new press release that says things have changed, but at, at the time of this going out it's the 2nd of December. Fingers crossed it will get a little better. It's especially difficult at the moment for players when you group with people. If you um, group with someone and they suddenly just disappear on your screen, keep them grouped as Naomi X Sky just did with me, and they'll come back into the group as soon as they re-log in. If you uh, remove them from the group and then try and re-add them, it seems to be losing them again. So the best thing to do is keep them in your group and just wait for them to re-log. And that seems to really work. I've noticed that quite a lot that works. 
Magic book here. It's not what I wanted, but... I'm just looking for the shrine. I always take a minute looking for this shrine because it's a little bit of a fiddly one to find. But it's just over here above the uh, boss. Oh, I'm too far up there, Ma. Yeah, I think so. It's a little bit fiddly to find. I end up wandering ah, around. I end up yeah, wandering around like, around like a silly sausage. There you go. Here it is. It's just right here by me. It always takes me a second to find it. I say to everybody I bring to do, because I'm normally a werewolf. I say to, oh, I'm just going to get rid of these giants, otherwise they're going to kill us. Um, I always just say to people, sorry, it'll take me a second to find it, because it's a bit of a fiddly one. Sort of the middle of nowhere. There we go. Right, so if we just head over so to the shrine. You'll see a player standing there right now. Very often some players will come and just stand here, hoping that a friendly werewolf will give them a bite. Hmm. Oh, I feel bad. <laughs> right. <laughs> Sorry, mate. Right, so for the purpose of this video, you need to push, when you're biting someone, you press uh, square and circle, and then you'll bite. Make sure you're next to the person and make sure you're facing the person because you can just bite anyone what's near you. Can you see this person can be bite? And that one's got a bite, it looks like it. So we're gonna purposely bite. Hey, excuse me. Excuse me, that, mate. That happens quite a lot. You <laughs> need to be careful if you're biting somebody that you bite the right person. Just make sure your crosshairs are on the person you want to bite. Right. Uh... There you go, and it sort of flings me on the floor. <laughs> uh, this person wants to trail with me. No fun. So what I can see now, where I've been bitten, is over here by the scroll, uh, by this skull. There's a blue arrow above it, and if I click on that, it says open scroll. Then it gives me a load of information saying, would I like to be a pop of Hersey? And as I keep reading, it tells me there's going to be a quest. I click on that and there's a portal that opens up that says portal to the great hunt. It's got the arena symbol or dungeon symbol on that looks like a little sort of uh, doorway and it says solo. So no one can join you on this quest, you have to do it alone. And you go in there and you can either go in there and uh, enter Hersin's realm and become a werewolf or be cured in there. So if someone bites you by accident and you don't want to be and you've changed your mind, if you go through this portal now, it's, it actually says, enter the Hercene's realm, which means become a werewolf, or ask a priest to cure you. So you can also go through this portal and be cured. And you just do a little quest in there, and if you want to be a werewolf, that's how you become a werewolf. Okay, wonderful. Right, I'm going to quickly show you on how to buy it in Guildstall and how to gift it, um, the werewolf. So I'm going to go main menu, crown stall, stall, uh, just so you've got other options. And then it is DLCs. Um, I think let me just go and check is it Upda um, upgrades 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 that's the one yeah upgrades tab so uh, if because I if you want the um, vampire it, the vampire line is there there is a werewolf because I've already got it I cannot currently buy it due to the fact I've already got it there is a cure on here like there's a full skill line full skill though. And the cure is 800 crowns currently uh, on the state. Uh, there's a cure and you can get the uh, the vampire skill line. Uh, so that's one way of doing it. Um, it says if you press R3 you can gift this to someone. This is how you give gifts, um, but they don't recommend uh, unless it's for a friend or someone you know, doing it to people you don't know, I wouldn't recommend doing it. Because one, it's illegal if you sell crowns to anyone and if you get ripped off, you give someone the crowns and then don't get the gold and then 
there's a big issue and a lot of it's not being solved right now and I don't know if there's anything else I need to vote to that. Is there anything else you can think yeah. of? No, you just need to be careful when, uh, especially with werewolf bites that you pay for, you just need to be careful with them because sometimes people will say they'll give you the bite, you give them either crowns or gold and they don't and they don't do it. So just be cautious who you, who you, who you do business with for a werewolf bite. And very often, as I said, try to get it for free through your guilds. We would prefer you to get it for free. And if you ever see any of us online, if we've got a bite, just ask and so. Yep. We'll yep, happily we give yep. you one if we ever happy. got one. Mm. We're always happy to give out wherever bites, but if you have kept, is there any more information or um, a couple of things um, that I could add is to level up your werewolf, I didn't realise this, with normal skill lines you just slot them on the bar and they automatically level, but with the werewolf it doesn't work that way. You need to have the werewolf on your bar and you need to kill things in werewolf form for it to count to level your werewolf. If you don't kill things as a werewolf, it won't level. Uh, my werewolf didn't level for two days because I didn't realise that, I thought I could just put it on the bar. And also, a lot of people ask me how you get the white werewolf. Um, it Eventually, when you get high enough in the werewolf skill line, you'll get the ultimate. There are two ultimates. Naomi is chosen by the looks Berserker, which gives you the dark-colored werewolf and gives you a higher damage per second. Apparently, it's a stronger one if you want a higher damage per second. But the other one is called Pack Leader. It gives you two werewolves that fight with you, and that's how you become the white werewolf. So if you want to be a white werewolf, you need to choose Pack Leader on your ultimate. And I think that's everything that I can think of that questions that people normally ask me. If you have any questions, please feel free to message myself. I'm not sure about Lisa. Would you mind oh, absolutely. people? Absolutely. Might. Yeah, absolutely. Quite if happy. You, if you just message one of us, um, we'll be happy to try and answer your questions. A lot of information is go on Google, so please Google some stuff if you if you but if you're getting stuff, don't feel like you can't ask people. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm now Mate Sky, bye for now and have a lovely day. Take care. You not saying goodbye. Goodbye. Come. Take care. Not saying your name. <laughs> Oh, sorry, it's a James one. Sorry, <laughs> sorry I, I, this is only my second video. My apologies. <laughs> Have a lovely day, everybody. Thank you for watching. Yeah, see you soon. Bye.